Hey what's up guys this is Vimal here and welcome back to TRHD. In today's video we're gonna check out this awesome binoculars from Olympus. It's an 8 to 16 x 40 zoom GPSI binoculars. Now why would you get this binoculars? What's so special about it? Zoom. Yes, it supports zoom. It can zoom from 8 to 16 x and this binoculars also provides UV protection to protect your eyes from harmful sun rays. So here you can see a picture of the binoculars on the box. This is how it looks like. The price of the binoculars on the box is 6490 rupees but I got it for about 5700 rupees from Amazon. I'll just leave a link to this binoculars in the description box below. Nothing much is written on the box, so let's start with the unboxing. The binocular comes in a nice carrying case. Along with the binoculars you also get a product manual and a warranty card. Let's just keep them aside and check out the actual binoculars. This carrying case is of good quality. It feels really soft and can protect the binoculars from light damages. You've got the Olympus branding over here. So let's just open it. The strap of the bag is neatly packed in it. This is the Olympus binoculars. It's nicely packed and you also get a neck strap. Let me just take it out of the cover. It's a good quality neck strap. Now let's check out the binoculars. Here we go. Wow, these binoculars are pretty solid in the hand. They weigh around 800 grams. It feels heavy. The build quality is also excellent. It's made of nice rubberized material for extra grip in the hand. Over here you've got the Olympus branding. 8 to 16 x 40 zoom DPSI UV protected binoculars. It's a poro prism type binoculars which produces bright images with very less distortions. And this is where you need to attach the neck strap. Let's just remove these lens caps. The eyepiece is also of good quality. You can see they are coated lenses. Now let's check out the objective lens. The objective lens has a diameter of 40mm. They produce a good quality image with high brightness. These lenses have mono layer coating. You got an Olympus logo at the center which doubles as a tripod mount. You just need to unscrew this cap to fix it onto a tripod. This is a focus knob. You can rotate it to focus the image sharply. The knob is really smooth. The focusing mechanism of this binocular is very good. The movement is also very smooth and frictionless. Here is the angle adjustment mechanism for your eyepieces, which can be adjusted from 60 to 70 degrees according to your comfort. This is a zoom lever. You can zoom from 8x to 16x. This lever is placed in a comfortable position, so it's very easy to use it. You also have a visual indication of zoom range at the bottom. And this is the dioptric correction knob. You can rotate this eyepiece to adjust the diopter as per your requirement. These binoculars can be used with or without spectacles. The overall build quality and optics quality of this binocular is really top notch. So let's go out and see how good the binoculars is. I'm gonna show you a few video samples. I'm at my terrace watching birds and buildings and from my first impressions I have to say that it is very easy and comfortable to use it. The image produced by it is sharp and is really bright at 8x. It has a field of view of 5 degrees at 8x and 3.4 degrees at 16x and the closest focal distance is 10 meters. This is the actual scene shot on my Galaxy S7 and over here you can see the binoculars view at 8x magnification. The image quality is good and sharp at the center and at the edges you will find slight chromatic aberration and vignetting effect. The image is also a little bit softer at the corners. Now I'll show you a sample image at 16x magnification. The subject was at least 1000 to 1500 meters away from my home. Here I can see a person sitting on a wall which was almost not visible to my naked eye. But the image was very shaky at 16x, so I recommend using a tripod when zoomed to that extent. Here at 16x you can see the chromatic aberration has increased at the corners, image loses its sharpness and the brightness is also reduced by almost 30% and you'll see strong vignetting effect. But still, you can easily identify objects that are far away. So that was it guys, a quick review on Olympus Zoom DPSI binoculars. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel for more new awesome stuff and I'll see you in the next one.